Good evening. My name is David Clegg and I'm addicted to drumming. It has been eight hours since my last session. <laughs> I've been playing the drums for the past three years, five months, 23 days, four hours and 38 minutes. I want to start with a story. When I was a boy, my father sat me on his knee and told me tales that his father, a jazz musician, had told him. I, one day he sat me down with a very serious look in his face. I sensed that he was about to share some great wisdom from the world of music. David, he said, do you know what you call those people that hang around with groups of musicians? No, Dad, I replied innocently. He looked down at me with those sage brown eyes and said, drummers. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is not an uncommon view. Drummers are viewed by many as a necessary evil not terribly bright, not very musical, and perhaps a little unsavory. Even my childhood here was the Muppets had a crazy drummer called Animal, who was always kept chained to his kit. If you are someone that shares this dim view of drummers, then in the next four minutes and 30 seconds, I hope to change your thinking. I hope to convince you not only that drummers are not all mouth-breathing Neanderthals, but also show how percussion can improve your life, what I like to call the Big Bang Theory. My first point is that drumming makes you smarter. Professor Frederick Ullin from the Karolinska Institute found that brain activity that is observed when a person maintains a steady beat is also important to the problem-solving capacities measured with intelligence tests. This was confirmed when Glenn Schallenberg at the University of Toronto found six-year-olds getting drum lessons had greater improvements in their IQ tests than children getting voice lessons, drum lessons, or no lessons. Drumming also chills your brain waves. Even the shortest of drumming sessions can change beta brainwaves to alpha brainwaves, creating feelings of calm and tranquility. They also over, uh, result in overall feelings of relaxation and well-being. Here is Grateful Dead drummer Mickey Hart taking part in an experiment with neuroscientist Adam Gaisley, measuring brainwaves during drumming to find out more about how the mind works and how drumming can help patients with illnesses such as amnesia. Drumming also provides friends with benefits. Drum therapy isn't always just an individual experience. Robin Dunbar, psychologist at the University of Oxford, found that when drummers played together, they produced a natural high, increasing their endorphin levels and pain thresholds. In fact, drumming was the cornerstone of modern civilization. Rhythmic euphoria may have been crucial in mankind establishing communities and society. Essentially, drum circles were the very foundation that made human society possible. Drumming is also very good for your body. According to Michael Thwatt, director of Colorado State University's Center of Biomedical Research, when you play or listen to the beat of drums, you generate connections across all parts of your brain, even the areas that are damaged or impaired with conditions like ADHD or stroke. But the benefits of percussion are not confined to neurology. Drumming also has a po uh, considerable positive impact on our immune systems. Neurologist and music expert Dr. Barry Bittman says drumming allows for unparalleled creative expression that we've really been able to show it changes in our biology. Drumming also makes you much happier. In one study, 62% of participants who took part in six weeks of rhythm and drum work found their mood improved significantly. Drumming also has a very significant sex appeal. In his book, The Descent of Man, Charles Darwin speculated that musical notes and rhythm were first acquired by the male for the sake of charming the opposite sex. A recent study by Dr. Benjamin Charlton at the University of Sussex seems to collaborate Darwin. When women's menstrual cycles gave them the best chance of getting pregnant, complex music makers who apparently have better genes suddenly became compellingly attractive. <laughs> Since before any of us were born, our physiology was orchestrated to move to a beat. Throughout our lives, percussion engages us through its enriching effects of rhythm, its stimulating and therapeutic beat, and its sex appeal boosting, IQ enhancing power. Drumming resonates with the very essence of who we are as living creatures, how we live together in communities, and the ways that our minds measure the passing of our temporal existence. At the end of the day, when the rhythm stops, our physical lives are over. So in conclusion, ladies and gentlemen, I exhort you to embrace your inner drummer and lock on to your sense of rhythm because each and every one of you has it. It's just a matter of tuning. As author Simon Sinek says, don't quit, never give up trying to build the world you can see even if others can't see it. Listen to your drum and your drum only. It's the one that makes the sweetest sound.